the niggas that didn't get the message. Bad to bad like I'm on the cover of Lethal Weapon. Bad to bad like I'm Jordan 96, 97. Whoa. Very important. Yo, people. Back to back like the cover of Lethal Weapon. I love that Drake song. Uh, but yeah, I thought I'd start the video with some action. See me doing some back workouts. And today was a quite intense workout. I did feel a hella pumped when I did this workout. And I'm just happy that I'm able to film and edit this video for you guys. Sorry for the lack of footage, <clears throat> of vlog, vlog, vlog footage anyway, from me for the last uh, week. It's purely because this new job literally hasn't taken up a lot of time. But yeah, so I started off with um, <clears throat> lap, lap pull down. Then I moved on to, uh, I want to work on the lower back more. Because of my back, that is probably my weakest area, the lower back. So I'm doing into like the, um, <clears throat> kind of like the rack pulls. More or less, try and get it popping, man. Because it needs to be done. Uh, so I did like a good, I think, four or five sets of the rack pulls, and with the, uh, everything else was four sets. So with the cable rolls you see now, I did four sets. And you can see the striations in my back, man, so I'm happy. My back, my upper back area anyway, is definitely like one of my strong areas. Because you see the definition points, and then technically I'm not even like super uh, lean. So I'm really happy that you can see the definition coming through. So, you know what I mean, I'm trying to upgrade everything and pump up. Okay, and as I said, lower back um, gains, so I'm trying to do more lower back stuff. So as you can see, I'm on screen, I'm doing the dumbbell, <clears throat> like, Romanian kind of deadlift. And, well, Romanian rat pull, Romanian deadlift, whatever you want to call it, basically. I try and keep my legs not too bent when I'm doing it. And just trying to focus on my back, kind of pull up, and just kind of make sure I can feel it in my back when I'm contracting at the top. So all I can say is that this workout does definitely, I, I feel sore for like two days, so I'm happy I added this in. Initially I had this instead of rat pulls, but I've, I've decided to do them both now just because I really need to work on that lower back and pick it up. And it is a killer, I'll tell you that. Also obviously you still got to work on my biceps because I do it on back days. And yeah, I've officially fully I'm changed over to the 14kg now for the isolated bicep curls. Uh, obviously before I was doing 12s and sometimes 14s, but now I can just do the 14s. So hopefully when I can do the full tw for, um, four sets of 12, I'll move up to doing 16 kg. At the moment it's like the first three sets, I get 12 and the last one I do 8. Okay, and also you can see me carrying on with the biceps, wanted to do at least two workout movements for it. So I did the um, cable bicep curl. And the reason I like this is because obviously it's constant tension because even when you're on the going down, instead of just having gravity pull you down, if you control it and the cable more or less helps strain your arm still. So obviously it works your arm a bit more. My elbows should be more in place, but at this point I was just shattered. Not as an excuse, but yeah, just for future reference, any of you want to try this workout out, try and keep your elbows more in place like than what I've been doing there because that's not correct. <laughs> But yeah, there's me faffing around. And this is probably the last work I ended on. I ended up doing pull-ups. Just doing a nice weighted uh, pull-down movement. Pull-down. A, a vertical movement, sorry. And you can, see this, you can see the definition in the back. And I was happy when I saw this when I saw the video back. But yeah, man, I'll see you in the next bit. I might have cut myself one of these one day. Goals. Yeah, let me take out the license plate for you, like Robin. Want it something more? Oh, I like that note. <laughs> <laughs> to the crib. Uh. This dip, this dip. Uh. <laughs> it's the new version. Who said you can try and sing? Y'all know I'm the singer on this, on this YouTube channel. And maybe Junior, my guitarist. <laughs> Junior is hard with it. Junior is funny, man. He needs to make his own YouTube channel. Alright, I'm asking not that damn me now. A post workout shake. First time you have a protein shake in like back three days now. That's probably longer than three days, probably like four or five days since before Liverpool. So yeah, but not that damn me. I do love the vanilla. So yeah. Mm. Perfect. So yeah, I'll probably see you guys tomorrow. Uh when I start cooking, I'll be chefing. Whoop it real fast. I ain't gonna say the word. Singapore noodles, stir fry and that. And, oh, prawns, we've got prawns. And I defrosted a whole bag of prawns to add in some protein and shit. Tap that with it. More or less trying to make my own kind of like Chinese, basically. I haven't had Chinese in, well, a good six months, so I thought I'd try and do it now. So stay tuned, I'm gonna mix it up. I'm gonna make it cracking, I'm gonna eat. 
go gym, make games, you know what it is. And for those of you that said that you have Snapchat and you'd like to add me on Snapchat, I'm going to be making a Snapchat. Like, I've already made the account, but I'm not going to like put it out to you guys. Until basically I know what I'm going to be putting on it, so I've got time to actually make sure I've got time to Snapchat. So if any of you guys would like to add me on Snapchat, let me know below. And I'll, that'll, kind of, that'll make me more eager to make your life. More people have Snapchat and want to add me. I'll be more likely to rush it rather than just taking my time. Like Alright, I think that's cooked. Fire. So yeah, hopefully that tastes decent. Uh, so yeah, so I'm gonna eat that now. I'll let you know if it tastes good. It's about half of it. Most likely I'm gonna eat the whole pan. I plan on having uh, some for tomorrow, but I thought I was gonna make more than that. It's like half it, seed and pan. So yeah, I'm probably gonna eat that, eat this, give it about half hour, eat the rest of it. Then I'll make it again tomorrow because it's not that hard. Ah, uh, people, I officially left that job now, I just came back at a half day, so yeah, I'll finish that job now, so I'll start my new web designer job next mon Monday coming, so about four days time, I've got the Friday off, which will be cool, so I'm going to try and have some videos edited on that Friday, so during like most of like the first beginning of next week, I've already got videos up for you guys, so I ain't got to worry about that, so that should be cool. And right now I'm about to just make some food, which you guys saw me have, like the, the veggies and stuff, so I'm not going to build it again. Um, so yeah, it should be cool, man. But yeah, about my leaving dude, you saw me buy them Krispy Kremes, right? Them bitches didn't even get me like a good buy card or anything like that. So next time, straight budget biscuits with the white packets. You ain't getting no damn Krispy Kremes for me. Them bitch. See, yeah, I knew it was not got Krispy Kremes, though. But fuck them, I've left that place. That place is dead. Will Smith. First time listening to the radio in God knows how long. And I finally find a station. Who's on it? Will Smith. Willennium when you was a kid was a shit. So yeah, we're about to go to gym now. I was decent enough to give you a lift because I'm just that properly today. The car's clean and everything. I'm, looking, I'm feeling fresh. <laughs> first of all, why are you swearing? That's yeah, first time I've caught you swearing on the camera. I'm, I'm glad I got that. <laughs> all right, you can see Korean on screen doing a little bit of chest. Uh, what was it? Whatever well, chest. Anyway. Back to me, because this is about me, right? I'm <laughs> joking. Um, but yeah, I started off with uh, doing chest today. It's only got a few clicks for you today, but I started off doing um, 60 kg, more or less, because I'm going to start um, bulking again. I want to try and see what my strength is looking like, because I know for a fact in the chest area, I definitely lost some strength over the last month or so. So here, I think on screen now, I'm doing 90 kg, and I only get three reps out, and normally I can get like, not like a huge difference, but normally I can get four out, sometimes five when I have a really good day. So the fact I can only get three out, I didn't really feel too good about that. So I'm hoping it was just a weak day. Because even when I went over to dumbbells and did my chest press, I felt weak. Um, as you can see, I got the 26s, whereas I think cause last time I managed to do 30s. But that, bear in mind, when I did 30 kgs, that was when I did um, the dumbbell uh, chest press before I did barbell. So obviously the barbell this time could have tied me out. But yeah, I'm hopefully, hopefully over the next uh, few, well, I think I've got four months to like January to like potentially go on holiday. I can try and build up some strength, but predominantly gains. And here you can see me texting my bitches. I'm <laughs> joking, I ain't got no bitches. I ain't got no, yeah. And here you can see me doing like a different tricep movement. It was just rap. The things happen to be this. I thought, let me try this out, see if I feel any more tension than I do. Obviously, you get to supinate your wrist. And yeah, I did feel it, um, to be honest. Whether it's a <laughs> better than the other ones, I'm not sure. But it was just nice to just try something else different while I was in the gym. And yeah, I felt like a nice little pump in my arms. My elbows should also be more in place. Like, here's not too bad, but the first good one. Let me describe her head on teaching her thing. She only just found out just that triceps is three parts. I'm calling her out. Like, I was like, she goes, why do you think it's a tricep machine? Because the tricep may have a different muscle. She's like, what do you mean? I mean, there's three parts. Is that like caught with it? Caught with it slipping. If any of you people didn't know that your tricep has three uh, bar parts just like Kareem, you're in the same boat as her, so now you know, innit? And if you don't know, now you know, yeah. So yeah, on screen I'm doing the chest flies. A lot of you guys know I like doing this more than the cables nowadays, because I think I can squeeze a lot more. And the form I'm doing isn't too bad, like usually sometimes I used to sometimes like end up having my wrist bent like a bow, but now I'm doing it rather decent. So yeah, thanks for watching the video, and I'll see you in the next, next video. I be doing dumb shit. He be doing dumb shit. It's remixing the words. That's Tyrus's song. It's fuck. It's the shit. Right. I'm gonna end up basically end this vlog now. And but before I wanted to end it, I wanted to say 
I think I'm just still trying to gauge what you guys want for the channel. I think I'd say 50% of you like the long vlogs, like over say 30 minutes. Probably about 30, 35 of you percent of you like like vlog the vlogs are like capped at 30 minutes. Then there's like about 15 to 20 of you percent of you guys that probably just like the short videos about like anything. So I think uh, I'll try and start doing more food videos, like say. Uh, meal titles like in at the moment all the new meals I make I just put them straight into the vlogs But obviously from the title you guys won't know that because in the vlogs I give them random titles like Superman that weight bro or scene games So I think some of the food bits I do I will separate them out into their own video It's like a, so it's like a short probably like three to six minute video max um, Video just telling you how to make a quick meal so like quick meal videos I'm not gonna call it a series cause I don't wanna like attach the word series to it to make you think it's gonna be like weak or something because really video like that and I try and do a structure with annotations on the screen and things like that it really does take hours of editing and with my 9 to 5 job and actually going to the gym filming it's just a lot of um, a lot of hours in a day where I just can't do that consistently but I will try and make sure to try and do them every so often so I can't tell you when the next one's gonna come with that but I think for now when I'm like cooking in my vlogs if I think I've got time and I've got time to edit it as well, I'll probably just separate that section from the vlog and I'll at least do like a how to make a quick and easy meal and then I'll just do like one, two, blah, blah, blah. I and mean, then at least that way I can make a playlist for you guys that just want to see meals and you'll see the title meals and then you'll be good. Because some of you guys ask me for things um, that are actually in the vlog, like sometimes you'll say, oh, what do you eat or what do you have pre workout? Stuff like that. I'm like, they're in the vlogs, but sometimes people don't watch the full. Um, 20 minutes and they miss out on it so I think this would be a way of me doing that so yeah stay watching the channel stay getting games stay doing anything and I'm, I need to make a t-shirt that stay getting games but anyway peace out like comment subscribe follow me on um, Instagram Twitter I'm tweeting like mad these days I'll say follow me on snapchat soon I've made it I'm just waiting when to actually release it so yeah but yeah, stay in games. You know the drill. Last night, they put up on my nigga at the light like, uh, nice watch, run it.